I think that at that time in my life, which would have been happening naturally, I sort of coincided with that program because there was a lot of my development as a young, as a young human being, as a female, that it was happening simultaneously with that program. I was the first one to leave out of the call cast. I was only on the show for the first year. Um, I felt like I'd had my, my drink full at the end of that year. Um, I had this very strong gut feeling that I wasn't going to get much more from the experience. Not that they weren't offering it, I just think that I had clocked out. It took me a few episodes to really understand exactly what was required for that role and for that project. And I, and, uh, and I look back with great trepidation <laughs> on some of those earlier um, episodes. I don't know if I, I'm very proud of my work. It was this really organic, uh, you know, sort of rock and roll, student style, you know, film, TV making machine that, that slowly evolved over time. I got quite ill at the end of that shoot and I think it was just kind of, you know, dredging the depths of my emotional quarter to, um, to bring that kind of vulnerability and, and sadness and depth to the character. It was, it was a really memorable experience for me. And I walked on set and I felt so out of place because I hadn't been part of this world. And I didn't know what was going on. There were all these relationships that had been formed already and the whole vibe of the, the crew, you know, they were already on that sort of tra trajectory. And I was, I sort of felt a bit out of it actually, which I think in hindsight helped to contribute to my character's journey.